It seems like just yesterday that Esmeralda and I were living happily on our humble caravan. Times were tough, but I was a good man in bad times. Then we were blessed with a child. I needed to find a way to make ends meet for the baby. Some questionable decisions led to some even more questionable decisions. Soon enough, I spiraled out of control. He then found me. You see, with a man like Cannamore, he can't play by any rules. I soon found myself a hitman among men who didn't hit. I couldn't live with myself. I fled to America to make a better life for my child. I became a potato farmer. I had become the man of most potato in New Jersey. And then they took her. My sweet Esmeralda. And I would do anything to get her back. Jake, put my f***ing pants back! I don't need pants while I'm on set! Who the f*** do you think I am? Hello and welcome. I am Kevin J, and I'm the writer, director, producer, screenwriter, and most importantly, the lead role in my movie, Kevin J Drives Fast. Kevin is not the director at all. I'm the director, I'm Drew Bramson, and I'm leading this production. What I have to do is take control of everything, run it the way it's supposed to go, and take care of any problems that there are. And there's a lot of them, mainly Kevin. All of them are Kevin. So I'm Alexa. I am going to be playing Esmeralda in the movie. I am, what's his name, Kevin's, I forgot his name, I forgot it, Kevin's wife. Um, I'm super excited, I mean, I always, I've, I've been in theater and stuff like that, but um, nothing super big like this is one of my biggest roles I guess I've been in so far. My name is Tyler, and uh, I'm going to be playing the villain in Kevin J Drives Fast. I really haven't done much film work, I've done a little bit uh, community theater type stuff, and uh, so I'm hoping this will lead to more work, and I'm, I'm really excited. Hi, I'm, uh, I'm Jacob Janus, I'm Kevin's personal assistant, and I'm the, uh, the prop master here on the Kevin J Drives Fast. Um, so I'm the uh, special effects guy, I, uh, my name's Lee. I. I'm in charge of the explosions, my favorite part of my job. I love explosions. It's it's just amazing. Right, maybe, I maybe you gotta sit back down. Alright, sorry. It's an action movie, so there are gonna be explosions everywhere, like coming from here, yeah, gotta, here, yeah, there's gonna be an explosion gotta, over here, uh, you know. Alright, cut. I'm Brian Farmer, I'm Kevin's agent, and uh, I'm kinda concerned, honestly, that everyone around here is being a bit too childish and sorry, hold on. No. No, I don't have time for this. I'm in the middle of an interview. Alright, Mom? Kevin J, well, he's got some extreme raw talent. Really talented, but I feel like this movie I could do him in if it's not done right. Listen, I'm a professional. Hold on. Right, can you bring the boom? Okay, too close with the boom. Up there. No, no, it's not right. I'm Nick. I'm the filmmaker. Um, uh, I'm here to do pretty much whatever the talent requires me to do for him. Um, you know, get a coffee, you know, get some makeup. And uh, I also make sure that the props are good. We, um, we have what we need for every scene, and it's, uh, it's going to be a good time. I'm really uh, more trained in Meisner technique, but uh, for this one, uh, I'm going to try the method. So I'm, I'm going to go away for a little bit. Uh, after today, you're just not going to see me for a little while. Yeah, I've met Kevin. He's he's a character, definitely. I definitely think that he's a cool guy, I guess. Um, super friendly, pretty friendly, I guess. A little, I can work with anybody. That's no problem. Method acting is essentially becoming the character you're portraying. I'm going to completely lose myself. I'm going to forget I'm Tyler, and I'm going to become the villain in Kevin J Drives Fast. Basically my duties here on set are to make sure that the scene goes smoothly, to make sure that things keep rolling, and um, I make sure that Kevin has everything he needs to feel comfortable and to make sure that he is in a, uh, a healthy work environment. The villain is named Canomore. That's who I'm going to become. Um, he's actually loosely based on someone we know, so I'm gonna be taking a lot of character traits from that person and putting them into the character. I decided to make this movie because there's three things I'm good at. Driving fast, being awesome, and being a complete badass. 
So welcome to the greatest thing you're about to ever see in your whole life. All right, well right now we're shooting this scene where uh, Kevin J shouts in the rain. It's been a little dry out, so uh, we're having we make the rain. Yeah, a little good. bit more over here. Uh, a little more over there. A little more, a little more right here. Oh, that's great. There you go. Yeah, yeah, get the whole car, get the whole car, yeah. Just do the whole thing. Oh, right. a, little, a little bit, up there, up there. So you know you can tell it's raining. Yeah, 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 make sure that's wet. Make sure that's wet. That's, that's not wet, the whole thing's gonna be wrong. Starts. I got this! Come on! I am the tiger! He took your girl! Ah, he, he took, took my girl! girl. It's Morella! It's Morella! It's Morella! You need it! You need it! You need it! You need it! Ah, my eyes. Okay, that's enough. <laughs> 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 So that shot wasn't that amazing, as you can tell, but we're handing it over to Nick and he's going to do some editing and post-production. It's going to look pretty legit. Uh, you're not going to be able to tell it from any Hollywood movie. It's going to be pretty, pretty good, I think. I'm kill you! You're going to say something? No. <laughs> Are you wearing booty shorts? How long? Yeah, so what kind of music did you say we we're gonna try to find? Oh, uh, you, you think you could find some maybe like John 5? I actually heard about this band called Fish. I, I thought we could give yeah? it a try. Yeah. Let's see what they're made of. I looked it up. I have a couple of ideas too of the soundtrack. Alright, let's hear them. Can you guys like do things that need to be done? So um, we're here yeah. today. It's the uh, third day on set. Uh, we're gonna be doing the the driving scene. Yeah, the scene where I drive fast. You know, like the the, the main one where I drive fast. Yeah, he's he's gonna be driving fast, and um, we're gonna have Lee, his uh, stunt man, do the uh, the barrel roll out of the car, and uh, hopefully it you goes don't want well. me to get hurt. And I get hurt, no more movie. Yeah. So uh, let's see what happens. All right, I'm get a professional. Just gotta plug in the electricity cord. Bring the electricity all the way over to the action over there. We have power! Wait, we should be closer My to the hands. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Dude, I'm You're thinking no umbrellas even. Oh. It's a lot brighter without them. Look. Yeah. Oh. Well, this one's not on. Uh, roll speed down, roll speed, check, Ready? and action. Go, go, go! Cover him, cover Kevin. Cover I'm Kevin. cold, I'm cold, come on! He's cold. Thanks, man. Go, go, go. Lee, come. Alright, ready? Yep. Alright, you're jumping out in three, two, one, action! Uh, Alright, scene three, take two. Action! Kevin didn't put the car in the park. It's just my hands and pure Volume. testosterone. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's it. I need some help with the, the B-Rig here. Oh, yeah. That's my cue. Alexa. Hi. What's going on? Nothing. 
So, uh, what are we doing after this movie, after this set? Gonna go home. Really? Yeah. Like, my house home? Or like... No, like, like my home. <laughs> Alright, whatever. You see that set? You see that, you see that shot I just did? Yeah. What'd you think? I thought... Pretty cool, right? I thought Lee did pretty well. Who's Lee? Uh, you know... You mean the guy who wasn't rolling out of the car? No, I'm pretty sure he was rolling out of the car. Pretty sure you should start paying attention to, um, what we're filming here. You know, I like you as a person. Yeah, I like you. I like you a lot, actually. Do you, yeah? Yeah, I do. Okay. You got somewhere to be? No. Because, um, I don't know, maybe we can go grab a couple donuts or something, you know? Yeah, you could grab some. I'd like one if you went out and got them and brought them back. You go together? No, it's, I have stuff to do. Sure about that? What? Hey Kevin, we're gonna start the next scene. Oh, sweet! So Kevin doesn't really know much, I think, about a personal bubble because he seems to pop it every time he enters a room. I really think me and Alexa are starting to hit it off. So that last scene was probably the best scene we've done yet. Like, I don't think... Kevin, I got the we... coffee you asked for. Oh, really, Jake? Thanks! Does it taste good? Is it good? So I hope you like sugar! So when we were shooting the scene where uh, Kevin Jay's driving fast and uh, he rolls out of the car, I, I had a bit of an accident. I thought I just twisted my ankle, but you, there's a pretty clear break. Uh, but yeah, I'm a professional. It's not gonna, not gonna hold me back. So uh, Drew's scolding Nick right now for uh, being director for a day without telling him. I kind of messed up. I thought I could be director for a day and be Drew, but I... Nick thought it was a good idea to be director when I wasn't there. He said he, said he wasn't mad, he was just disappointed. I'm not mad at Nick. I'm more or less just disappointed. And that, that hit here. He took my hat. And this hat was my dad's hat. And he didn't direct anything. But I wear it when I direct. And I'm just, I'm just hurt really. That's it. Yo, shut the f up! Hi, uh, I'm Nicole. I'm the makeup artist and costume designer. I don't, I don't know what the costumes are gonna look like, but I know how they're gonna feel. I know it. Jake. What did I tell you? Didn't I? Did you not read the contract? It's in the contract. Kevin doesn't have to wear pants. Jake! The strangest thing about working with Kevin is that he prefers not to work in pants. I'm a little offended that Kevin decided to pick out his own costume. I mean, I'm the expert. He's messing with my vision. Every different production team always asks me the same question. Kevin, why no pants? Simple answer. My career needs to be let free. I need to have the, that flow, it's the wind. And you think about it. If you're wearing pants, you have this whole thing going around you, really grabbing you. That's like what it does to me. All right guys, I've been up all night, I'm working my ass off, I made a couple edits to the script, and I want you guys to look over them. Tell me what you think. All right, let's see what you got. Homework. That one, it's mine. All right. I mean, Kevin, this is great and all, but it's it. I mean, that's the problem. That this is... Drew, listen. Let me explain this to you. Picture this. Jake! So, Kevin, I don't, I don't see where the explosions are going to come. Fuck you! Dude! Language! That. Uh, I don't know, dude. I have a problem. I don't know what I'm this supposed one, to do. This memorize. one right here? Yeah. You know what we could do? After this, 
you and me, we could work on these uh, these lines, this whole scene actually. We could work on it together if you want. Um. I don't know exactly how I feel about this whole me and Alexa thing, because when we're on set, you really need to try and keep things as professional as possible. I mean, I'm all for what she wants to do, but I think things are starting to get a little bit out of hand. There's a line, and I don't want to cross it. Kevin's crossing the line. Here's the line. Here's me. Here's where Kevin should be, but Kevin's right here. Right here. He's become so creepy, I can't even handle it. Do you know where he, where he touched me? You know what she made me touch? Yeah. It's kind of it's kind of cool, but kind of weird because we're on set. I mean, when I'm on set, I'm Kevin J. But when I'm off set, I'm Kevin J. So she really needs to know that difference. You know what guys, just, just forget it. Give me the scripts. Come on. I'm just gonna write this on my own. This is, this is a disaster. I'll get back to you guys next week. Just forget this. The table reading was a complete train wreck. I mean, I know going into this, it's us, and we're gonna goof around and things are gonna go bad. I just hope the rest of the movie isn't like this. Otherwise, it's gonna be a long haul. And some of us probably aren't gonna make it. I'm gonna fucking kill you. <laughs> So when we began work on the film, I, uh, I made a chart detailing how I want the uh, explosions to go. And we haven't really stayed true to that, and I, I really want to bring a lot more. Uh, the, the really important thing is at the end, we're, we're definitely going to climax here. And actually, it's going to go way off the charts, and we're going to be in a state of perpetual explosion by the end of it, going into sequels, of course. Maybe a trilogy. And I just want to, you know what I'm saying? We're all here on set, uh, ready to film the scene where Kevin J drives fast, but Tyler didn't show up, so we're gonna go out looking for him. I have a hunch where he might be, because, you know, I'm, I'm a professional. I know he's here. He said it's behind Lowe's. Tyler! What the f- I wanted to go fishing, and it felt right. You're not my dad! Dude, I was on my way to the set, and I just, I saw Bailey, and I, I just wanted to go fishing. I, I just thought I should go fishing. It just, it felt right, and, and I did. So, that's that. Alright, come on, Ty, you don't even know how to fish. Aren't you allergic? So we're shooting the scene where Kevin, Kevin J drives fast, and um, Kevin J's late. Seems like everyone's kind of late today, actually. Ow! Guys, I'm late. I broke the stunt, man. Kevin J is not liable for any driving fast-related injuries. Jake, you're the new stunt man. So today, Kevin asked me to go a little beyond my own limits. I uh, I don't think I could work on the movie anymore. Um, I'm not gonna endanger myself for the sake of the project. It's it's just not worth it to me. So I'm I'm, I'm quitting. I'm not gonna work on the movie anymore. Uh, lately, I think the stunts have been getting a little too dangerous. I've been getting hurt every time every time I try something. I think I'm gonna take a step back and I'm just gonna do the special effects. I, I have a guy that looks just like me, therefore just like Kevin. 
you know, I'm a professional. I'm going to have this covered. Um, I think the stunts are going to look just as good with him, if not better than they did with me. So, apparently, Lee got a guy that looks just like me. Probably won't be as dashing as me, but I think we can still carry on if we have another stuntman. Got him. Perfect. Oh my god. Something about the new stuntman just, uh, just... Just off. I can't really put my finger on it, but... So, the stunt double for Kevin J, he, uh, doesn't... I don't see the resemblance there. Um, just, just not quite the right match? I think it's his hair. I think he has the wrong hair color, but, uh... Without Jake, Kevin doesn't know what to do. What, what is this? I, I don't understand. How Kevin, am I supposed to do this? Kevin, it's not that difficult. It's a belt, a button, no, and a zipper. No, 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 no. Like, what, what does this do? You pull, what is this? Those are legs. How I, no, no, you know what? Screw it. No, I'm done. No more movie. I quit. Enough. I've had enough of this. Get, get that out of here. Him and Alexa are gone. I don't know what happened to her. So, I think this is pretty much it. I don't really know where to go from here. So... It's due in a week. I don't know how we're going to make this. All right, cut. <sighs> I don't know what we're going to do, man. I think it's done. Let's just wrap it up. I mean, if we could if we could find Kevin J and just finish this thing up, we, we might be able to do this. Yeah, but I mean, it's Kevin. I have no idea where he could be. He could be anywhere. But it's Kevin. I think I might have an idea. I knew we'd be here. Do you know what this means? So... I quit. So, Alexa quit. Ever since the whole White Castle thing where Kevin J held her at plastic knife point, she just hasn't been herself, just shaken up more or less. But on another side, Tyler had his moment of clarity, and uh, he found his true calling. Dude, I found my calling. I want to teach. I'm thinking English. Dude. The project's due tomorrow. I mean, I just got nothing left to give. I mean, I'm, I'm not even taking this class as final. What am I doing here? I'm, just give it a neck to finish. He'll do whatever. He always makes it look good. Terrorista. They do the Harlem shit.